Good morning. Sorry, we're running a little bit behind. Um, I feel like we're going to start every stream that way. Um, but good morning. Come here, Daisy. The dogs are all outside right now. We're going to bring them back in soon. But um, we are about to make coffee and all that good stuff we put. Um, <clears throat> we got the kids on the school bus and then we had to... Um, take care of but um so sorry we're a little bit behind but we're here um i saw linda um linda um good morning to you uh, we hope you're well we have a fun mcdonald's story from we went to mcdonald's yesterday and um we never have a good experience at this McDonald's and they just never fail to surprise us. You're <laughs> still heated about it. I'm, I'm still angry about it. <laughs> it's the worst McDonald's in the, the nation. I am certain of it. We call customer service on the board. <laughs> we call customer service, we've left reviews, and man, it doesn't get any better. Um, did you want to? You can tell us. We'll save it for a few more people on. Yeah, we'll wait for some more people. Because we even have. Uh, Bring the dogs in. Yeah, we also have. Uh, um, <laughs> items to display in order to back up our statements. Oh, yeah, we've got <laughs> evidence. <laughs> yes, evidence. <laughs> Um, oh, we're saying, Daisy, do you want to go see your non puppies? <laughs> your surrogates. Good morning, Lisa. Good morning, Amber. No takers on Bobby yet, but man, when I think about it, my heart, like, it breaks. It's going to be so hard. Good morning, Denise. How are you? How's Roman? Roman's mom is on? Yeah. Oh, how's Roman? I hope he's well. Dogs come in. Macchiato and Spike were soaking wet this morning when they came back in, so... He, yeah, I remember they go off somewhere, and it's like they go... I know, they look like they're coming back from... from this way, the one time I uh, see if they were done with the creek. I think they're going into a real brushy area. Yeah. Um, but we would love to hear anybody, as we wait for more people to come on, we would love to hear any of your um, McDonald's or other fast food, just a nightmare yes, stories. Yes, Tell us in the, uh, in the chat your, uh, your best fast food nightmare. <laughs> your, yeah, your best nightmare. I swear, I'm I'm convinced they did this on purpose. Like the little cherry on top at the end when we got home. I'm convinced. There's no way it was an accident. There was no way it was an accident. There's another question for you. Have you? Do you ever? Is there anything that has ever happened where um, you thought it was on purpose like that? Because I know that everybody's got a lot of horror stories. But do you have anywhere, um, or does anybody have a story where? Yeah, I think Do you the, think an employee did something on purpose? I think, like, remember, like, the whole thing for a long time, like, when we were young, was... Spitting uh, your food. Yes, yeah, spitting in the food. But now you can, like, get arrested for that. Yeah. That's a, so that's what it's... So now it's trickier. Yeah. It's now it's, yeah, exactly. They do sneakier things in order to, to ruin your food. Yeah. yeah. You want a couple eggs and bacon? What's that? You want a couple of eggs and bacon? Or bacon yes, and eggs? Please. No, I'm sorry. Egg and bacon. There we go. Okay. Um, I'm 
Thank you, kids. What's up? <clears throat> so, thank you, kids. What did the kids leave you? Brunch. Um. Let's see if Jamoka. She is like, she reminds me so much of Remy at this age because she's just. She's in her element in there with the puppies. Did you give them that food last night? I gave it to them this morning. Oh, okay. Because I just now remembered that. Yeah. I made it and forgot. Yeah, it looked perfect. And so I was like, oh, I'm going to give this to them. Well, it's moving forward. It's bad. Oh, Daisy, did you eat it all? Oh, no. It was like almost gone. I put it in oh. there. I put it in there an hour ago. Them too? Yes. Really? I ate here with Mocha. She was just. Was it was it there's still any moisture left? Um, like was it because I did uh it's a, completely absorbed. Oh no, okay. You're like the big oh right. Big old blobs. Big old nuggets of kibble. Oh you know I'm gonna pull the oops, I'm gonna pull the chairs out again just because that's easier to see the dogs. Chairs on the island. Five weeks old today. What? Are Myers puppies five weeks old today? No, I don't think they're that old. I have to look at the calendar though, oh, man. Their birthdays really um I think it would be so difficult to keep track of their ages. Myra is the, the third. They're they born are. on October 3rd. I think they are. So that's 28 days. They were four weeks old on October 30th on Halloween. Oh, yeah. So they're five weeks old today? Yeah, they were four weeks old on Halloween. Dang. Yeah, that's right, because when we did their dewormer, it was two days later. And they were four weeks and a couple days old. Myra's puppies are five weeks old today. Happy five week birthday, Myra puppy parents. No dewormer this week, just checks. <laughs> so we'll do those weight checks when we move the camera over. Um, if you couldn't tell, I used the webcam for the kitchen cam today. Um, and then. I'm going to move that <clears throat> back over to Remy's puppies. Remy and Myra's puppies. They're near pen, but the camera is just better for this sort of, this type of stream. We had fun mocha. You have fun in there with that? No mocha? Mocha? Was just sitting looking at them. Oh, she was wrestling them out of there. Yeah, now she's just like sitting there, like sitting on her on her butt, like. Doesn't she remind you? Right? Yeah. So I guess, you know, when they're eight weeks, they want to get away from the litter mates. So for a lot of puppies, being put back to the litter doesn't make sense. Hmm. I love it. So. Yeah, <laughs> Thank you. 
House and we were like, where are we gonna put a kitchen table? <laughs> do you remember that? I do remember. Why were we so confused? Well, because they had that giant old school ice chest in Oh man, I wanted that thing so bad. Yeah. That really was that antique ice chest. Yeah, it was so cool. Yeah, so when we were first looking at this house, uh, over here where Elizabeth is now punched over the table, or under the table, they had, um, like, an authentic antique uh, ice chest made out of wood where, you know, you would get a, a giant block of ice and put it in the bottom. Um, and it, but it took up a lot of space because it was so big. It wasn't right here. Yeah, it was right there. Yeah, it's it was like here. But they had like a little area around Yeah. Yeah, we're all good. I think we thought with that thing in there. This is a table we had a castle main, right? Yeah, it is. And I think that when we first looked at this place, when we saw that that nook, must have been kind of expecting a breakfast of the size of castmates. Yeah, exactly, yeah. I think that we were thinking that um, it goes off the back door, so that makes sense. Yeah, true. Where is it? Oh. Where is it? Like my castmates? I was just going to say that I think that when we were looking at it, and that um, ice chest was there. Um, it made it look a lot smaller, and so we didn't think that the table was going to fit, but the table fits perfectly. Yeah, it's like it's Man, I can't believe how much this goofy little thing holds. I hope you're being reasonable, Daisy. No! 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 Oh, no. Oh, that's what we got the shop bag for. Bam! Wrong. <laughs> Everything I, well, not everything, but a lot of what I swept up when I opened up the bath, it kind of like flung open. Oh, no. no. But that's what the shop takes for. I can't, I still can't believe how much it holds though, like how much it picks up in one go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Your little human powered sweeper? Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe it. Unless I do feel like Yeah, that thing has awesome sauce. It's going to be perfect for like, when we do have an office and we have smaller spaces like that. Yeah. That's not what the whole shop back out for. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
No. Is it still working? No. All right, sorry about that. Huh? Dogs, no. Okay. Lisa asked, is Mocha still Drew's shadow? Probably even more his shadow now. Yeah, she, like if she isn't playing with the puppies, then she's, and if I'm in here, she follows me around. Come on, Daisy. I sort you in the kitchen so you don't take the camera with you. Your egg, my dear. What? What? Mocha? The tray is 
Oh, no. Trey, he's right there. Not, nope. Nope. I got cl- This is a classic example of... Um, like, she's like in it. And then... Yeah, she went in it, and she was walking around, and then once she started finally pinching it off, yeah. she was... Because she does these UEs where she goes like out and goes back in and it's like it follows a nice perfect view. <laughs> I didn't even, um, when I grabbed the disinfectant wipes, I was like, no, I'm not going to put them under the sink because we're going to need them. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, you little stinker. The Boca is um, just about pom pom size. I know. Size. Oh, do you want to share your McDonald's story? Yeah, I guess we can share the McDonald's story like now. There's 22 people on the thing. Yeah. So, like Moses said, the, the school um, that uh, Bradley and Bella go to, yeah. the elementary school that's yeah. nearby. Every year they do like a fundraiser at the local McDonald's, which is like three miles away from us. And um, it's always like, you know, the, the kids really want to go, but Elizabeth and I are like, oh boy, because it's, it's crowded. It's crowded. You got parents and then all the kids. And so the kids are just wild too. And and, McDonald's sucks. And the, yeah, and, and, yeah, keep in mind, this is the worst McDonald's in the nation. Uh, so we go inside because the kids wanted to go inside to see if any of their friends were there. So we, we, we would not sit down to eat. Yeah. So we offered to go inside and pick up our food inside. Yeah. Because I mean, it took three minutes. Like, yeah, it, it, took it takes so long. Yeah. So we go inside. Uh, we go up to the register. We place our order. And I realize probably like, Ten, you know, for like, well, like five to ten minutes later, I was like, oh, "Crap! I didn't ask for it to go." And so uh, I was sitting there, and I saw our order like up on this the screen or whatever. And so I went over, I said, "Hey, order one twenty one." I forgot to ask for that to go. And so somewhere in that, our order completely gets lost. Like they, I don't know if like they're like. Oh, this one needs to be a retouch. I imagine it was one. like I don't think this part was purposeful because I think that like yeah. when they went to switch it over, they probably accidentally canceled it out. Yeah, if I canceled it out or something, like that. so um, that it delayed. It might appear like it was everybody's first thing. Yeah, exactly. It Even the like... original manager that was there. Yeah. yeah. So, so that happens where our order gets gets lost. So I have to give it to them again. And then, uh, and this by this point, we've been waiting for like twenty five minutes. Yeah, it had been about twenty minutes or so, and uh, we finally got our food. And I had to like I was sitting there like at the counter, just being like, "Hey, you know, we've been waiting a while. Is our food almost ready?" Blah blah. blah. Finally, after thirty minutes of waiting, we get our food. We get the kids together, and we go back out to the car. We get we home. check for our food. Every yeah, week. we. Check yeah, we always check for our food because they always forget they something. They always miss something. They always miss something. Yeah, they always miss something. And they made sure to miss something. something yeah, but I, I checked our bag and we had all of our food. And so I was like, okay, thank you, folks. They gave us a little voucher for a free sandwich because it took so long. And so we were relatively like, okay, you know, that all was lost. Yeah, it was like, we were like, okay, you know, yeah. McDonald's sucks, but at least this time they gave us a little voucher yeah. for a sandwich. Yeah. So we get home. We get the kids served all their food. I had ordered myself a uh, big crispy chicken. So we finally sit down. I go to pull out my sandwich. I'm like, huh, this feels a little bit light. I pull out my bun, and that's it. Just this. It's a pickle sandwich. It's a pickle sandwich. No, yeah, no crispy chicken patty in it like somebody put those pickles in there yeah somebody put the pickles in it somebody put the bun into the baggie oh man so that was when i kind of exploded at home and of course we're you know now we're we're five minutes away we're back at home and it's just not worth going over there so 
Anyway, that's that's our story. And this I was I was willing to go over there because I was you and were, I was mad. Yeah, you were really angry. But it was like because it was the kids' thing, we didn't want to like make a big deal out of any of this. Yeah. Because there were parents there who were like embarrassing the hell out of their children. This McDonald's sucks. Yeah. <laughs> like it wasn't just us. Yeah. But I do think it's kind of yeah. funny that they found a way to miss something in our food even if we checked. It was like they knew they're gonna check and they knew that they wanted to leave something out. Maybe they leave shit out on purpose. I don't know. I don't know. Because they were sneaky enough to put the sandwich in there in its bag. And somebody give you the sandwich. Anyway. I, know. I, I couldn't believe that. Like it was a completely flabbergasted. One, two, three, four. Oh, my goodness. Here, I'm going to phone. I'm going to put a cat here. I'm here. Oh, good. Oh, I better change the. Oh, you know what? Actually, I have my phone. Linda says she got an empty container of fries. What's that? Linda says she got an empty container of fries. Oh, she's so. That's terrible. Like the. The fries, that's even worse. Like, how do you how do you do that? How do you put an empty thing of fries into the bag? Like, because you can actually see it. Man. Lisa Mickey. <laughs> Lisa Mickey says that when that happens, she calls the store and complains and it leads to, let's say, get off her chest. The thing about that is, is it happens so much and we have called to complain so much that they believe literally just they say, okay, we'll let them, you know, we'll re-educate. And it happens so much that they don't give out vouchers, probably because they would lose a lot of money. So much money. Um, there's no, like, there's no rectifying it. They just kind of, they take it under advisement. There's so many times where I just... We I'm, call the regional office. Like, we've really, um, we have tried to help them. We've given constructive criticism. <laughs> I just, I'm curious if, like, they can recognize us now. Oh, Beth said she had a band-aid in the burger. No! Oh, oh, that... That was a long time ago. Oh, man. What? It's making me sick just thinking about it. Oh, the gross thing about band-aids is just how intimately close they were with somebody's wound. Exactly. And if you put that under your food, it'll be going in your mouth. Oh, man. Never eating McDonald's ever again. Especially that McDonald's. Yeah, not that. Though. It's like sometimes we go there and we're like, you know, it's not busy. It's three o'clock. It's not busy. You know, surely they can handle a couple of value meals with Cokes. You know, like some simple. This really <laughs> They never do. I told Drew we need to stop tally marking when things went wrong. It's a little bit, we need the opposite. We start tallying yeah. how whenever we do have a good visit, like yeah. that's a win. Yeah, exactly. We need to start tallying the wins because the losses are just too great. You know, you're such a good boy. Rio's in here? He wanted to come in. And he and Paris got really close and May started to bring him up to bed. Oh, that's Bradley doesn't bring Rio to bed anymore because ever since Rio went through puberty, Bradley is, doesn't want to sleep with him and his balls. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bradley's grossed out by it. The thing is hilarious. Yeah. Rio and his manhood. <laughs> So May's been bringing Rio up with her in Paris, and she's having a fantastic time because Rio's so snuggly, and Paris isn't really a snuggler, but Rio is. 
Um, she says it though, he is not at all considered, like, he just lays across her. Yeah, he, he doesn't. <laughs> he's not a very considerate snuggler. Courteous, he's not a courteous snuggler. Delicious. Oh, and I promise this short for Oh, Where it is. I know you guys are free. I don't know.
No. No, we're back. back. No, oh, back, back, back. Ah, uh, did it again. Dang it. Wait. 
Yes, good girl. Yeah, so we, I didn't get a call because I didn't know. It's like, hey, it's tomorrow. Oh, so um, they were going to call you today. I remember I was spacing out, and I don't remember exactly where it was the night. Oh, oh, man, that's bad. <laughs> yeah. And so when they said the eight, I was thinking it was a big four. It's like, we'll rather say the four. And so that's where we got a whole day before seven. But yeah, so he has a it's not on his birthday. It's not his birthday. Yeah. Nice. But, um, so, well, I was thinking that's better because that's what I kind of wanted was 2 30 and 3. So, I don't know if we're going to do that. So, um, if we have to be leaving like that area, might be no later than two. Um, I'll probably, so I like the idea of bringing them back here first. Brushing out their backpacks, yes. School, especially. Yeah. Um, my mom used to always make us do that before we had uh, dentist appointments. Like it was. Do you remember the orthodontist appointments where you, they had you brush your teeth in office? Yes, yes. I'm surprised they don't even do that with the dentist. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I remember they always had, like, the, the orthodontist office that I went to, they had, like, a station. Like a, mm -hmm. Like, like it was like four sinks all around. Or no, no. It's like little historical toothbrushes. Yep. Yeah. 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 Ours was just like a, a half bathroom, like a quarter bathroom. Oh. Like a little really? pedestal sink. You know what? I think the back, it was, yeah, it was two sinks on the wall right when you entered the, like, the main area. Oh, they, I just think it was like a big walker. It was probably, it was, it was just like a regular office. You know. Could you? Could you? These are. Um, these are not. These are not the ones. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Oh, and then everybody needs eye phones. Really? Need to figure out this thing. Yeah. Okay, Pom Pom. You gotta wait, Pom Pom, so Deanna can finish eating. Deanna is the last year. Oh, she only eats one time. Yeah. Is there a piece that you wanted in here? Um, I would like one thing that, like, so these two work together, those two. Oh, okay. So, like this guy, and then okay. love you. Oh, we go. I have a person that looks too crispy for either of us. Oh, really? Mm. You know why? Yeah, I turned up the heat because it's my fault. It's taking a while to cook. <laughs> It's kind of tasty though, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Beth says, I had to laugh last night when Bella put me in the on her slide. <laughs> I forgot about that. That was yeah. so much fun. <laughs> that was so funny. We took Bella upstairs. She was, um, you know, it had been a long day. She just needed some time to collect herself. She's so sweet. I'm so proud of her because she is, you know, she's about to turn six years old and she had the thought, the forethought to say, Can I grab Vienna? And she came over to the kitchen right here and she was grabbing Vienna. And so we let her take Vienna upstairs with her. <laughs> And um, Drew and I are down here talking with the, the, the live stream, and she comes down with Vienna. Well, first we heard, like, a bunch of thudding. Yeah, there's a lot of thump. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's true, yeah. Nobody ate at all. Really? Yeah. Even mocha? Even mocha. Leave those two with that. I'm not fair. Paris, come back here. Let me see. Paris, come down. No. Oh, 
Oh, Mocha ate their leftovers. Oh, gotcha. Mm. And so Bella came down. Vienna's in like a, a bear hug. And Bella has a big, giant grin on her face and starts telling us about how she sent Vienna down the slide. Yeah. Down the slide. So that explained the commotion. But Vienna didn't like yell, even Bella was so proud because she, she thought that, that meant that Vienna is kind of like a pro at going down the slide. Um, because she was very proud that Hannah didn't yell or be get upset, or um, she was just. That's what makes a good ESA dog for, um, especially for younger kids, are um, the ones who they they may not like what the, the situation with, um, like with kids, you know, even um, you know, just family dogs. We try to desensitize puppies to some of children's antics, but with an ESA and, um, you know, when we're trying to have them be therapeutic in nature for young children, when they can tolerate that sort of thing um, from, from their ESA person, <laughs> um, it just, it, it goes really far because, like, Bella came down with, she was so proud of herself. She had so much pride. And it completely turned her around. Like, it, that's exactly what Vienna was supposed to be for. It completely turned Bella around. She was really proud. And, um, you know, she loves calling herself Vienna's mommy. Yeah. And she's teaching her new things and giving her new experiences. And because, you know, if Vienna had started crying or yelping, Bella would come down here in tears. Um, because she does get really upset if Vienna is upset, especially if it's something she did. And so... Um, I'm sure it wasn't a lot of fun for Vienna, but I'm really proud of her for sticking through it for Bella. Um, and in the meantime, we've had to talk with Bella about not setting Vienna down the slide. Yeah. <laughs> so don't worry, we're not. Slide is not meant for dogs. Yeah, we're not. Um, we're not saying that her pride should be rewarded or she should continue. It's just that she's proud of. Um, she was just proud of, yeah. she believes that she, yeah, she was get, trying to get Vienna out of her bed. She, her bed is like a, kind of like a loft bed where it, bottom of the mattress is about this high and it has one of the slides at the very end. And it's not steep by any means. And, um, but for a puppy, it probably feels a little steep. Um, and so she was proud of being able to get her out of her bed without um, needing help and having to ask. So. She was explaining how she like sent her down and she had her all positioned so she could go down safely. But we'd rather she do that than try to go down holding her. Or try climbing down holding her. Yeah. Or just dropping her overboard. Yeah. Or her overboard. Yeah, it's such a good question for Bella. She's really gotten big. Sometimes I look at her and mistake her for mom. I know. Yeah. Um, she has definitely hit a growth spurt. She is. And what about the mocha dog? Mm -hmm. She's such a good girl. Really good. Mocha smoka. Mm -hmm. You are such a good girl, Mocha. Mocha Jamoka. You are such a good girl. Mm. Thank you. Oh, it's gonna open that channel. But I have to go all the way here. I'm gonna grab the business phone though. So What is Paris doing? Uh oh.
insert the other strings. We need to pull out Remy and Myra's puppies and get in there. Yeah. We probably drop the shot back in there and clean up a lot pretty quickly. Oh, I don't know why YouTube does this. When I put when I start a new live stream, I'm doing all the settings. Um when I first post it, it always makes the thumbnail fuzzy. And so after I make the whole link, I always have to go back in and just re-upload the very same photo. And then it'll clear it up. But I don't understand why it does that. Oh, yes, that is why Bobby was in a carrier. We took him to McDonald's. Yep. That was a lot of fun. He got a lot of compliments. He was happy little Bobby. And he just fell asleep. I have a couple pictures of him. Um, he just went to sleep. Surprisingly, despite all the noise. I know, it was crazy loud. <laughs> so cute. Children running hither and thither. There's Bobby. Asleep in the carrier. Not a photo. <laughs> They're pretty much the same photo. This one's closer up. But his eyes are closed. He's snoozing. I tried to keep like a little bit out of the restaurant so they weren't like, get that filthy animal out of here. Because I know they're weird about like, um, um, animals. Yeah. I suppose I could have held it up a little bit closer. I forget how like how much this camera. There we go. Is that too close? Oh no, that's perfect. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, I didn't see this much um on the computer. I didn't, the computer doesn't show this much. Yeah, it doesn't. It, uh... They realize it's showing above the cabinets. Yeah. It's actually broadcast. Right, yeah. As you guys can see the trim on our door right here. Oh, what? The shoot up part. Um, that's what I was talking about the other day with um, our puppies and chewing. How when they go through their chewing phase, and really with all of those poor puppy habit phases, it really is just a phase and they don't ever like it doesn't become a habit that we have to later train out of them like they're not chewing on our for like our bedroom furniture or the sofa or the dining room furniture and um if anything what's been kind of nice is they just kind of pick at the parts that have already been chewed on yeah so they, they're just working on things that have already been damaged yeah usually the puppy like when we bring a new puppy into the fold it's not like they find something new to chew on it's usually like Oh, looks like someone chewed on that. Maybe yeah. I should give it a You're try. You're like, oh, this must have been good. Yeah. So, but that's kind of, um, it's one, like, I guess, silver lining. But um, overall, the puppies, my whole point, though, is that um, it really is just a phase. When I was doing, um, when my family was doing, um, we were doing rescues, and we had the foster dogs. Um, they were primarily English Spare Spaniels, um, but we also had a lot of Border Collies because we did Border Collies, we did um, dog sports, and one of them was Border Collies. And so, um, one of the things that I have noticed in our time since having Cavaliers, I thought it was kind of normal for, for just all dogs that any sort of habit they like a puppy habit sort of thing, just like chewing, that if you didn't stay on top of it, then it did become a habit you had to train out of them. 
And so when we first had our Cavaliers, I was like all over the, the puppies about chewing on like anything. And once I learned to like relax a little bit, um, I started noticing that Missy just kind of grew out of it. And then we had Spike after Missy and he, he didn't even, he wasn't even as much of a chewer. I don't think Missy really was either. Um, uh, uh, they're both more diggers. Yeah. And that, and you, you fixed that one with the, uh, supplement. Yeah, supplement. Yeah, supplement. Drew was against me taking Bobby in the pink carrier. <laughs> I was very against that. But I figured if I told, if anybody asked his name and I said Bobby, we could pretend he was a girl. Yeah, I guess that's true. Good the OBBIE. Yeah, good enough. Yeah. Female. They're not checking his wiener. <laughs> Jump. I just, I, when somebody comes up to you and the starts at, I hate to be all, they were like screaming as a girl. I don't want to be, make them feel awkward and be like, oh no, the boy. Like I just kind of go along with it because I don't know. I don't want to make strange people feel uncomfortable when they're coming up to compliment a dog that we're holding, you know? So. Oh, 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 oh. I forgot that the webcam has the whole objects in webcam are closer than they appear the situation. <laughs> Her head whenever she was listening to you. You know, sipping. Where's where is she? Mocha. She's laying on the bed again. Oh, is she? Mocha. That. Yeah. Oh. She is very, very expensive. Mocha. Mocha. Good girl. Oh, you're gonna come get along. She's like, oh, daddy, I love you. I love you, Mocha. You're the best. You're <laughs> Daisy. Hi Daisy, hi Paris. I know your person's not here to give you loves. Pom Pom's like, I don't have a person. Oh, I see what's itching you. Hi. Oh, you gotta give them more ice cubes than that. I'm gonna just get him up for Mocha. 
Isn't that mean? <laughs> no, she's my mocha. All right, buddy. I just open it like that. Or I'll be mad at it. Like I'm... Oh, you have any fun. That's yeah, wrong. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> See? <laughs> she just chases around and kicks off. I know. It's. But, well, like, it is like some type of fun. Yeah. Oh, you want me to go and get the laser pointer? I'm sure. Ooh. I'm not sure. Is the live station fun. dogs and the laser pointer? I think they, I think they have a while ago. It's probably with her crew. Probably was. <laughs> She heard ice cubes. Oh, ice cubes are like the dog's favorite. For me and my dog. R O B I N is passed out in the potty tray, and Maisie is passed out on her neck. Oh. How they lay up on her neck. Uh -oh. Uh oh, she's not talking about her. Really bothered. Yes, I just started smelling the puppy things too. Holy smokes, did you see the amount of poop in this pie tray? Yes, I did. Holy Jesus! I didn't realize the puppies were using it that well. She needs the uh, scooper. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and I noticed that as I was getting food and whatnot. I was like, oh man, I need that. Your tray is already getting breaking down. What's that? Their tray is breaking down already. Oh, geez, really? Yeah, but um, I think it just goes to show how well they're using it. Yeah, that is I scooped true. a lot of poop out of there. Yeah, it's a, it's a good sign. How much? Um, quite a bit. Like, Oh my god, that's a new bag? This is a new bag. Oh yeah. no, you're dripping. There's, there's a hole in the bottom. Oh no. Um because this is the stuff that the moms couldn't eat. Right. Got it tangled up in litter. Right. Oh dog. Daisy. He's guarding her ice cube. What's left of her ice cube? Daisy. Ridiculous. Back out. Oh. I will say, um, Robin has really been surprising us with her continued. Yeah. Um, like she's still in with the puppies right now. She and we brought her out. We potted her. She wants to be in there with them now more than she was when we were when we had her in our bedroom. Um, yeah. yeah. This is what's coming back.
Shelly, I'm reading your story right now. Shelly wrote, my adult son ordered a pizza online. Somehow it didn't go through correctly. They delivered him an empty pizza crust only. He said, why didn't you call me? Who would want that with no sauce and toppings? Yeah, you can go to the grocery store and get one of those DiGiorno pizza crusts and just warm it up in the oven. That would have been the same thing. That's crazy. Like, who would have... You have to make some decisions to get to that point where you are delivering only a pizza crust <laughs> and no sauce. What? It's a, or what? cheese. or it's just oh. It was a pizza crust in a box, warmed up. That's ridiculous. <laughs> That's just... I very much oh, it's so funny. Good morning, Shelly, by the way. It's nice to see you. Oh my gosh. I knew you guys would have some funny stories. Man, it drew last night, so like the whole thing had gone down except for discovering the sandwich. We were we had made it home and like, you know, you like shut the door behind you and you kind of take like a breath. And you're just like, all right, you know, we're home. We're home now. <laughs> and I went to use the bathroom in our bedroom and I'm, you know, walking out, you know, also just feeling relieved, you know, we're not going to dinner and that's it. The night's over. And Drew comes in and he doesn't even look at me. He's just pacing. <laughs> I was just like, are you, everything okay? And he was like, they didn't put the chicken in my sandwich, just very calm, like just, and, but his face was not calm at all. <laughs> his, face, yeah. his face was very, very like, the clenched the jaw, the very, the typical angry. Man, you look pissed. Yeah, that was. It was one of those like, he can't say anything or else he's gonna unleash like F bombs and stuff. Yeah. It's like, that's what it looked like. Yeah. Exactly how it felt. And they want $15 an hour. 
Yeah, that's some crazy thing. I'm not opposed to like minimum wage being raised and all of that. It's more like right. how it's applied and how yeah. it's said. Like some jobs just aren't served fifteen dollars an hour. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, because I mean, I, I agree that like these people are making your food for you. Like, right. Like there's a lot. A lot at stake. A lot at stake. A lot at stake.
Jesus. Uh, Jesus. Her no. Zero name. Um, I could help. Yeah, Drew, the live stream is just black on my phone. Live stream is just black on my phone. Thank 
I want to get May this hair tinsel for Christmas. Just sort of cute. You should put it in. I was really surprised that she, um, usually she is a little more reluctant to do something that's uh -huh. drastic. Let me show you. See. Maybe it's because, uh, oh, yeah, it's on the white side. Or what? Um. Oh, there we go. Now it's working. All right. <laughs> Man, I love reading some of the Chinese interpretation. What is motivating you to take down everything off the fridge? I'm just getting all the old stuff off. Um. So, like the way they translate, it's like an air engine. The handle design for each one. Oh man, that's not funny. so sure. <laughs> you got a clear? Yeah. No, it's called white. Mm -hmm. 
Um, you know what? When Bella comes home with all the stuff she wants us to keep, let's tell her to pick one to put on the fridge. Yes. Because my side of the bed is just getting flooded. Flooded with stuff? Yeah. I would say, yeah, take the stuff that's on your side of the bed and then um, start like making her pick one. And see, like this, I'm keeping these ones that are like nice. Yeah. Like this guy, especially. Aww, yeah. You eliminated it now. Yeah. Uh. Oh man, this was... yeah. welcome to the fourth grade. It's kind of an important one. Oh, here it is. Found it. Said what? 
that one uh, tripod, that one, the little one that we were looking for. Oh, that's not the one I was looking for. Oh, uh, wasn't? No, that's, <laughs> that's the one I had been thinking of. Oh, this is a decent one, though, for being little. Yeah, so it is. Yeah, we so, yeah, so we have to do the same thing as I mean, I just got a message from May, but I can't text her back. Bad? No, 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 nothing bad. So. Oh, that was a pretty good thumbnail for me for the kitchen cam. Now that it's not blurry. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, I like the Rio's Harris. Harris and Pom Pom just could not look any less related. <laughs> I know, they look like. Oh, yeah, Says, what if Drew had asked to hold the pickles? <laughs> uh, <laughs> so then he really would have done. <laughs> yeah. That would have added a whole other layer to the mystery because then it would have been like, okay, well, did they not put the pickles on because you requested it that requested way? No pickles? No. Hey. Yeah. Ideas for chores. Oh, yeah, that looks like, um, yeah. I love this cleaning toilets one time a week. I like how they're uh, brushing dogs every other day. Let, let's see the kids keep up with that one. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> cleaning puppy pud. <laughs> Swiffery. I appreciate their um, offers to feed the dogs, but feeding is kind of just one of those things where yeah, like, it's so, it can be so crazy if you're not. Yeah. And like, I, they do often? I feel like I have got to do it. Well, I think it helps kind of keep a balance with the dogs when you're the alpha. Yeah. And you're saying, okay, this is what you guys can have. Especially if we haven't eaten yet. Yeah. But ever since we, ever since I noticed Daisy's behavior in bed uh -huh. with you and how they all run to you and check in with you and then um, how, what was it where I was like, oh my gosh, they're treating me like I'm running with you. And then I realized, oh, that would make sense. Because <laughs> you, like, they can't see us as equals and that makes sense, but I'm not offended by him. <laughs> Imagine you're not offended by it. No, I mean, 
that's how they live. So I'd rather play into that or like lean into it so that they they have a harmonious so I think they're more comfortable. They're more comfortable when their when their life is dictated by well when it's like in a way they can understand. And like in some ways, in like the traditional sense, I can see how dogs would just see me naturally as underneath you because you're stronger and like you can fix things that I can't sort of thing. So right. oh, yeah. it's like you're my backup. <laughs> Oh. Probably spending too long on a thumbnail. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm just trying to find a good thumbnail. I know it looks like I'm not doing much, but I'm trying to find a good thumbnail. Because Bella's getting bigger, I really, since she and May both need jammies, I wanted to get them some like girly matching. Not girly, girly. Is Spike just open the door? Spike just open the door. Oh. He's so good at that. Yeah. 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 Oh, 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 oh. The girl. The girl, Mocha. It feels crooked. Or like not crooked, it feels I don't know. Thank <laughs> you. 
You're getting invitations. Uh, getting invitations to come clean everybody else's houses. <laughs> oh, I am. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Silly me. Silly me. Uh, you know what else I have to carve out time for is updating our website. Oh. Because, like, you know, each time we have a round of litters pass. Right. All the information about the previous puppies. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, some people that I've been in contact with were asking for uh, if there were photos of, like, I don't think there's any photos of Myra on the on the website. Right. do with the beautiful trees is we should take the dogs outside for um like not all together but take them out and get some like current very current I know we have some recent photos from when I did the mugs wow. but I mean like while we have a nice backdrop and mm -hmm. then um you mean the going into like next year yeah like on our website and everywhere there's nice, there's recent photos of the dogs while there's a nice backdrop outside. Yeah. And you're talking about the, the evergreen trees over there? Right. Yeah. The, um, the, oh, Myra. She, she has been doing this. Are you okay, sweetie? What's the matter, sweetie? Are you not feeling well? Did she actually puke or? Yeah. Okay. She, well, she just like. It was like she was like, ah, crazy. Easy. Oh, I see. It, it, looks, it looks like mostly water. Yeah, well, it looks like, was she drinking water really fast? Uh, she she didn't, it's not like she vomited food. That's usually what happens. I've noticed that when she does that, it's after she has, she has sucked down a bunch of water very quickly. But she ate a lot of food, so where's all the food? Exactly, that's what I'm saying. It was just like with one gag. Like you just one gag throw. You know how you throw up when you're drunk? Oh, yeah. And you just kind of like, <laughs> yeah. you just kind of gag it out. Yeah. Like, yeah, it's not like when you're sick and your body is trying to get. Yeah. Trying to get that stuff off the bottom of your stomach. Are you hungry now, Yana Dog? I'm okay. Now Daisy's in the test. Yeah, I wanted to learn. Daisy, 
You know what? I I'd be happy to come and uh, and do some handyman work. I'm willing to rent out my husband. I was gonna say, you rent a Drew. Rent a husband. Rent a Drew. Rent a Drew. Rent a husband to come and you can work out a few times before you go, so that maybe you can be a little bit of eye candy while <laughs> Is the pump going? Is it the pump there? Uh, I can install ceiling fans and. You, you have installed a lot of ceiling fans. I have installed a time. lot of ceiling fans. I feel like you have a lot of ceiling fans. Which I always think is funny because, like, on those. Angie's List commercials, they're always asking for like a handyman that can install a ceiling fan. It's like, is this like a thing that people don't do very often? My ex husband didn't do it. What's that? Oh, your ex husband didn't install ceiling fans? My ex husband was not a Well, I, I am willing to, to guess that I probably have installed more ceiling fans than I can count on my hands. I would agree because I think you've installed. More ceiling fans. Just in that amount, it castle made alone. Oh, yeah, castle Remember putting the giant one in the uh, that, you know, the living room area? Yeah. That was sketchy. Yeah, that was one that I couldn't really watch. Yeah, you remember? Yeah, because I had the ladder on top well, of the even table. You admitted that you were like. Oh, yeah. yeah, that was. So when you're admitting that you're comfortable doing it, that really scares me. Yeah, that one was a little bit on the dangerous side. Oh, snort. Oh no. Thank you. 
We're going to have to put on our detective caps because my little brother has a different last name. And, um, Oh, yeah. Good girl, sunshine. Wait. I was like, maybe I'll tell you to find out what he's interested in. I mean, like, I don't need specific stuff, I just need like, I ask how many you have to. I'm saying to her, maybe you could ask her if you could get along with Bradley, then we can find out what you Hear me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Christmas, just in general, like, and we would do, but we use that as a, uh, as an alibi for yeah. trying to find out this, uh, this program. Yeah. 
large glass. A boy's large. Hey there, Diana. How are you?
Thank <laughs> you. 
Going to be starting Robin Strain here in a minute. So, if any families are currently waiting for Robin Strain to start, it will be starting. Oh, and Robin's lucky that the fans are kind of convenient for Robin, and they've done remarkably well. So, they, I just left it expanded. Uh.
There at the afternoon, I'm here with the Hawaiian Cubbies. No baby, <laughs> always a baby. Um, they opened up their pen. Okay, Russ, Robin has been spending a ton of time with him, way more than he ever has. So we open up the pen so you can hear more words. Um, and the puppy's potty training has gone so incredibly well. Um, usually we can see potty spots everywhere, especially when we open it up too early. Um, but they've just been going into the tray. You can even see some fresh spots mushrooming over there. Um, but this morning we came out. And they had poop in there, they were using it throughout the night. So, all those pellets that you see around, those are from uh, Robin usually wagging her tail in the tray. So, I'm just, I've got a brag on Robin's puppies because they're still just four weeks old. And at four weeks old, uh, we don't expect them to. So Robin's puppies, they have um, they have done really, really remarkably well with the setup. They we opened it up with it only four weeks old. We did about five weeks by the time that they're able to like wake up and sleep and go potty without um, putting themselves overnight. And um, they are so I opened it up to give more space to Robin, and um, I really expected them to have access to find little potty spots everywhere. And I've just been really, really surprised to see that they have not, they haven't been using this space to potty. They just, they just like use everywhere to sleep. You know, you can kind of see the, the whole thing is a sleeping zone. But um, all the pellets that you see lining the all of these, that's the rabbit's tail lining. That's why I wanted to open it up because for rabbit, she was sleeping in the tray. And I wanted to give her some more space. And I really thought that we would have to close it back up to the rabbit puppies for the potty. But they just leave them so well. Like, why not? They've done really, really well. They've used it as an opportunity to use the tray more. And something about it worked out nicely where you opened up this corner. And I think not having a dog bed in here has made it a lot easier because all of the spaces are there. And so, like they do, they, they play just like this, and they play just like this, and all of these spots. Whereas if they make, if they have like, if they were to in the past when we've opened up the closed off square right here, um, they won't sleep over here or play over here. They'll just use it to hide if they're not ready for it to be opened up. And so um, to see them kind of just move into it, expanding their sleeping and safe space. Up all the pellets, especially when our room's got enough space that she doesn't have to sleep in the body tree. We've got a mirror over there. We've had loads of fun with them in the mirror. <laughs> this is a blanket for Robin because um, 
I did a fast scroll through the stream from yesterday, and when she is not in a pen with her and she's not doing anything else, she's laying right here. You know, she doesn't always want to be in the pen with them, but she does want to lay by them. You know, if that makes sense. She wants to be near them, but she doesn't want them to be all over her or making a fire. Hey, 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 hey. Hi, Clover. Hi, Clover. A little bit here, you and I will spin the kitchen pan around. Pull some puppies out to play. Oh, she did pop her ears. Really? I I shared this story before, so I probably didn't say it at the time. But um, when I was growing up, we had this English Springer Spaniel. We actually inspired the German uh, It's Charlotte over here. Um, she was one of our foster dogs that was later adopted. Uh, she was very, very, very energetic, energetic, and then uh, fly ball in the building. Um, she got into everything, like everything. We would have to, um, we couldn't leave like anything on the counters that was even remotely edible or smelled good. She would eat it, even if it was edible and smelled good, like candle. She would eat it. And um, one year, and so one year, Christmas Day actually, she we wake up one morning, one morning, we wake up Christmas morning, and we do our day Christmas morning, but um, she's just been not acting right, and. We went to see her and we were just really excited. And so we took her to our bed. Um, and we did an x-ray and we did an x-ray and her belly was full of just some sort of mass. And um, um, so they did Emergency surgery surgery. And they pulled out over five pounds of 
into somebody's house or trash or something and some of the candy wasn't even out of the wrappers it was just in her belly <laughs> you were so silly it was just in her belly like a milky way for instance it was still in the wrapper in her belly and it was all starting to decompose and then it smelled really really bad and pulled it out um, but essentially, it was blocking her gut, and that's why her that morning she was just so bloated and lethargic because it had been it had been a scurry there and just um, sure you know producing gas and stuff. It was it was deep for me, you know, so bloat. Um, but it was a very explosive lesson and not leaving stuff. Dangerous from the car. Reminded me of she has an attitude a lot of babies. How old is she then? Huh? How old is Star in the heavens? Um, like three or four. Uh. Not when she's nine years old. What's crazy too is that that could tell us how long it had been in there based on its state of decomposition. And so, like, goes to show that um, we lived in the Chicago suburbs, so it's kind of a populous area, so we kind of talk like this. But he could tell, he, because we thought, like, I remember my parents asking, um, is this like Halloween candy that had been was old and left out when she ate it last week, sort of thing? And he said that, you know, it had been in there for once. So yeah. We got a big compliment to about the parents. You guys make these ones that are not like. Nope. I'm going to change the thumbnail on this to for dogs. Okay, dope. And then we'll over to my own army. Are we ready to bring the puppies out though? Um, I'm ready to, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, that's such a, that's a much better idea. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Take them to the kitchen. I don't know why I'm making it so complicated. Take a bit of ham. I've got a little bit of else I do. Oh. 
I'm thinking that we bring them in here. Because you know what? They'll have a lot of fun and slipping and sliding on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> and then we will, well, I think all, like, all that open space that they can just this puppy proof yeah. bring in all the puppies. Oh boy. Let's just do these guys right, first. We'll start, yeah. with we'll start with them. We'll start yeah, with them. We'll start with them. We'll start with them. We'll start with them. We'll start with them. Let's see. Let's put you guys in the body tray. Here's the body tray. Oh Fine. My goodness, I love when you guys are snuggled up like this. I need to change the body trays. Oh my god. Okay, so change body trays. Okay, you know, I'll put them in the other one so you can see where the different trays are. Oh, that one really needs to be changed. Hey, you know what? Let's well, this one this. is. Let's do this. That one's too small. No, hold on. Hold this guy up. One of the big big ones. Oh, potty. Let me go in the back door. Oh, there's dogs back there. Hold on. There. Oh, my dog. Um, oh, well, yeah. yeah. And, oh, they were outside, but I just popped them in. You want to put them outside? Yeah, go ahead and put them outside. <laughs> Yeah, okay. All right, you're good. So, the, the doors or the the schools are in the way. I'm not gonna be able to get to the thing through there. Oh, and of course they're fiddling on the floor. Oh, good boy, Bobby. Good, good boy, boy, Bobby. Bobby. Good, good go, Potty. Oh, Even though Slotty oh. was way there stealing your face. Go, oh. Potty, Bo. Oh, man. You made uh, a small early day. Who's? Small? Too big. Oh, too big. Too big. Oh, too big. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry, sunshine. Island of safety where we don't slip. <laughs> oh, 
all of these. Still got two more again, I think. Phew. Two more puppies. Good. Hi guys. Hi guys. Your puppers. What silly puppies you are. We have Charlotte. You are the last up. Man. Finnegan, you are one strong dude. He is. Finnegan, wow, that's impressive. Because the other ones, I guess, uh, um, Rocky is pretty strong too. He's doing all right. Rocky! Now nah, he's starting to slip. Good boy, Rocky. Man, you are strong. Sunshine is a little bit on the. Wait, here, let's just look at ours. Yeah, here. They want to. You guys are good. Oh, this one. Yeah, I think we're good to bring out a little bit. What's that? I think we're good to bring Robin to Because it's not like it's a dining room where it's something that they're used to. And so they're like going nuts. They're all really they're nervous to walk very I'm far. More, I'm more thinking of keeping track of all those puppies. You've never chaperoned class on field trip? <laughs> Not when all the kids look alike. They don't look alike. And you can count to 14. I can count to 14, all right. Oh. We're just all trying to send baby. Yeah. Oh, silly doggies. That can also scare you guys. I'm scare you. Oh, you guys are good. looking at um, the blue girls and like, oh wait, is that Rocky or Sunshine? Now, when I see her collar, it's just, that's Sunshine. That's what are you doing? How are you even able to find anything to latch on? Hi, sweet Charlotte. Hi. Hmm. It was so nice taking Bobby to McDonald's. That was so much fun. All his little tails first when I say his name. Bobby. Uh, Mr. Bobby. Oh, oh I love you. Bobby boy. Hi. Hi. Sunshine, you are so soft. You are so soft. Yes. Oh, I guess you're all soft. Oh, we're all soft puppies. We're all very soft puppies. Yeah. Everybody is a soft puppy. Yes, we're all soft puppies. Hi. Hi. Oh, I love all the kisses. I love all the kisses. Thank you for all the kisses. Bobby. Hey, buddy. 
Buddy, poor guy, he's so scared. So scared after the vacuum. Okay, I got you. I got you. Hey, Rocky. He's like, this floor is no big deal. Hi, sunshine. Hi, Tommy. Oh, Daisy, are you trying to... This is what Daisy does with the covers. She's trying to climb under, but with the puppies on it, she can't get under. Here, Charlotte. Come on, there. Now you can go, Daisy. Now try. Daisy. No, look. Hey, look. Look. Show them how you get under the covers. Show them how you get under the covers. Daisy. Now you can get under. Now you can get under. Look. Turn around. Turn around. Daisy. Look, now you can get under. Ooh. There, see, look. And now she doesn't want to. <laughs> All these puppies got off for you to get under the blanket. And now you won't. Oh, Alfie. See, you should have gone on the blanket and now then sunshine wouldn't be nagging at your ears. Oh, no. What? Uh, oh boy. Right here. Huh? Right here and I'll go outside. Oh geez. Oh. Hi. Hi, Finny. Hi, Finny. Daisy, do you want to get under the blanket? Not communicating very well. Or maybe I'm not communicating very well. I guess that's me that's not communicating well. Hi, Finny. Hi. Oh. And he likes his belly flaps. You're such a good mama, Daisy. Oh, wait, you're that Rocky. Oh, oh, <laughs> Finny, now Finny wants to play. And Bobby is like, I am not playing. I am not doing this. He is, he is such a homebody. Like, he just snuggles. He wants to snuggle. He doesn't want to play. He doesn't want to get involved. And he's going to make a really good ESL. Can I help you? Can I help you? Hi! All of you adventurous ones. You guys see Bobby? He's so sweet. He's latched onto me. Okay. Look. Yeah. Look at Bobby. He won't he won't do all of this. He's just scared me. He's just in my arms. He needs you. We have a, a birthday gift here. Yay. From you. Yay. You're such good little puppies. Oh, it's okay, buddy. Oh my goodness. He just he does not want down at all. Come by me. Come by me. Okay, Bobby. Relax a little. He's like super flexed. He's, he's not relaxed at all, poor guy. Okay, what's the matter? The vacuum's gone. Hi! Hi! Oh. 
puppies. Little puppies. You're a good girl, Daisy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Hi, Fanny. Hi, Fanny. Oh my goodness, you guys all look like little teddy bears. Macchiato really has that teddy bear look in all of his puppies. You guys all look like teddy bears. Okay. You're so playful. Alfie, Alfie. Woo! You are, oh my goodness, you are strong and athletic, Miss Sunshine. Miss Sunshine. Oh man, I can't wait to have Juno. We're here, Juno, over New Year's. I'm really excited to see how pretty she is because she was so pretty when we had her in that September. Was, yeah, that'll be a lot of fun. That's going to be awesome. I'm though. looking forward to that. Okay. Especially since we won't have any litters and it'll be kind of a. All right. One, I tried to move Bobby and he like <laughs> when I pulled him away. And he's like, no, 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 I'm so scared. Bobby. I don't know why he's not showing out now that the shop back is off. Yeah. It's probably just like he got scared and he's also in a new location. Yeah, so, so he just doesn't want to be unexpected. Oh my goodness, I love your little donut noses. I love your little donut nose. You're gonna look like Auntie Paris. Not really Auntie, but Auntie in the sense that it's another mama dog. <laughs> Can you see Sunshine's nose? Her snout um, coloring comes all the way down her cheeks and down her snout. She's gonna have a nose like Paris and it's gonna be so pretty. You are so precious. Yeah, to get some weights on you guys. Yes, Bobby. Hi. Hi, Charlotte. Hi, who's a pretty girl? Yes, she is. Yes, she's a pretty girl. Who's a pretty Charlotte? Who's a pretty Charlotte? Yes, I know. Sunshine's a pretty sunshine. She is. Yes, she is. Charlotte's so pretty. Charlotte's so pretty. <laughs> Hi, Jesus. Hi, Jesus. Oh, I love the kisses. Thank you for the kisses. Thank you for the kisses. Aw. Thank you. Oh, your breath is so nice. Yeah. Oh, I love you. I love you. I love you. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. oh my gosh, I love the sound that their mouths make when they're like doing kisses. They just sound so sweet. Hey, hi. Hi, sweetness. Hi, sweetness. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hi. Hi, Lottie. Hi, Lottie. There Daisy goes into the now she finally goes into the blankets. I need to go away, Alfie. Oh. Are you relaxing a little, Bobby? Hmm? Are you relaxing now? This little bed is like a playground for the puppies. Okay. This bed is so perfect for the puppies because it's big enough. The, for them. It's between the diameter, uh -huh. the height, the squishiness, and the blanket. It makes it like a little puppy playground because they roll around on it and then they fall, they like slide off the edges because it's so squishy and so big that they're it's so big that they are you know rolling around on it right. and then they slide off of it, but they have the blanket to play with too and kind of wrestle around. Oh. 
whole mm -hmm. new experience for them. It's kind of like, you know, those, um, is it like a wrestling arena where they've got a certain amount of space they can play. If they go too far, they'll fall off the edge. Oh, yeah. It kind of reminds me of those, uh, um, uh, bounce houses. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it is. It's like house. a puppy bounce house. It is what it is. Oh, sunshine, lighten up, lighten oh, up. I'm being hurt. She just doesn't want to share. <laughs> doesn't want to share you? Yeah, she doesn't want, well, she doesn't want to share the space. Oh, yeah. She wants to be the only pupper. <laughs> You're being kind of handsy, though. No, 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 don't do that. What are you doing, Stacy? I'm giving up. She hears herself like half twisted. It's so funny. They crawl on their moms and dads, just like how our infants did when they were 18 months old. I don't know. Like how Rocky was just standing on Daisy. I remember Bradley was just like balancing himself on Drew, and he would, you know, be on. <sighs> Uh, laying on his belly on the floor, um, yeah. playing peekaboo and whatever. And Bradley would come over and he would um, put his hands on Drew's back. And so Daisy's back, that's, that's what it reminds nice. me of. That's funny doggies. Funny doggies. Don't go after my toes. Don't go after my toes. Your toes are delicious. I need to do it. Like yeah, me and my mom. We want to Hi, Elfie. He's like, how do I get the primo spot? How do I get it? I'm so excited for you to meet your sisters, Elfie. I hope they bring his sisters. Hey, when are they coming? Oh, 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 oh. You mean they weren't? Want, yeah. Want them to bring, them to bring. I mentioned that we had families do before, but I with two other two, I don't know if they will. Yeah, that's uh, it's okay. They have a Robin puppy and a Missy puppy. Um, what are you digging? Robin at? puppy, I think, is from Robin's first litter. No, second. second. No, 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 first. Murphy's from the first. Murphy's from the first litter? Yep. She wasn't in the second. Taylor was a fall, right? Taylor was in the fall, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Murphy was in the first litter. Because Murphy, or I'm sorry, the first litter was uh, born in March. I'm born in March. Robbins was born January 27th. Oh, Robbins. I'm thinking of Missy's first litter. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, I'm thinking of Robbins. Um, but they have one from Robbins' very first litter, and then they have one from Missy's litter like a year and a half ago, summer of 22. So, summer of 2022. So not this past summer, but the summer before. It was like yeah. one of our first litters that we really live streamed with the audio yeah. on. Yeah. At Mutant. Hi there, Mr. Alfie. Alfie, you are such a big honker. Bert, are you going potty? No. I don't know. Oh, he's so unhappy. Oh, no. Oh, it's the noise. Oh. Hey, buddy. Oh, Daisy. I'm going to check it out. Okay. Oh, Bobby did not like that. What's that? Bobby did not like that. Too many noises. Rocky is in there watching Drew. So is um hey, Rocky. Is that what's up, Piper? That is um oh. is Finnegan. Finnegan. Finnegan is going for a pie break. Aw. Okay, buddy. <laughs> he freaked out and I was like, oh my gosh, what are you doing? And then I realized it was from the corner. He was spasmed. 
Yeah. Hey, do you need to go potty? You're dragging your booty hole. Come on, booty. Go. Ready? Go potty, Rocky. Go potty. Finney's right there if you want to slip him in. <laughs> They're so cute climbing in because the potty tree, it's a big one because yeah. it's for our dogs all the time. And hey, buddy. they look so sweet. They're so little trying up to it. These two, though. These two. Megan and Rocky. They are like. Oh, Finny. Whenever we talk about boys being snuggly and playful. I, I, I don't want to think of these two. You're not gonna think of this one. He's pretty snuggly. He's locking the camera. Oh, bleh, my butt. Sorry. Ooh. No, wait. What are you? Oh, you're just sniffing. Okay, good boy. Dude, he's like, I've had enough of those puppies. Hey, can we go get more? Rocky, Rocky, Rocky. Can we go get more? We gotta bring them out to play. We might as well do it when the other ones are out. Oh man, that's awful. All right, if you can hold Bobby for me. Just calm down. He'll, he'll be okay. Oh. He will be okay. I promise he'll survive. Watch. I'll 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 watch him. I'll watch him. Hi, Finnegan. Hey, Bobby. Good boy, Bobby. Good boy, Bobby. That's it. See, you're okay. You're not gonna perish. Hi, <laughs> right hey, Sunshine. <laughs> okay, Mama. He'll be okay. I promise you. Are you stuck? Are you stuck in my legs? He's like, why'd you put me down? Why did you put me down? Why? Why did you put me up for adoption? Oh, no. Oh, oh, sunshine. Oh, sunshine. Sunshine is stretching this out on her own. Why did I put you up for adoption? We need you to be a girl. Wait, how? It was like really stretched out. Yeah, that's how it was when I fixed it. Right, I'm gonna go get Robin's puppies. Okay. So we can um, have everybody play together. Hi. Hi, Charlotte. Oh, oh. well, excuse me, Mr. Rocky and Mr. Finnegan. Oh, oh. Finnegan, Finnegan, Finnegan. Hey, Bobby. Good boy, Bobby. Oh my goodness, but hey guys, you guys being silly? Whew. That's Go potty. Go potty. Go potty, puppies. Hi. Hey, Jen. Hey, Jen. You're so silly. Boop. Good boy, Finnegan. Hey, Bobby. Okay, Good boy, Bobby. Good boy, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. Hi, Bo. Hi, Bo. Good girl. We got a lot of tricolors. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's why I Good. We can get track of them. Um, well, maybe we, we don't get a tricolor mom. We, maybe we should get another one of them. Because nope. mated with Seattle, they're going to have a lot of tricolors. Oh, yeah. Wait, who did you just bring in here? Because Charlotte. Charlotte, you want to go potty? Oh, man, Robin's going to lose her mind if she sees Daisy. Daisy, we're going to have to move you. Oh, bless you, Finnegan. Go potty! Go potty! Go potty, pups. Not over here, though. All right, Daisy, you're going to go and hang out in our bedroom for a bit. <laughs> oh, my. Hi. Hi. Who is that? Oh. Hey. Sunshine, what's wrong, Sunshine? Sunshine, are you stuck? 
Turn here. Yeah, I wonder if Robin's going to be able to tell which one to. Yeah. Because I don't think they have an actual like number count, you know, on their heads. Sunshine. Big you know, and we easily slip off with one or two if they don't even notice them leaving. Right. They're not, they don't look at the litter and they're like, ooh, who's Wait, this? someone's where? missing. Yeah. I gotta, I gotta, oh wait, the camera won't reach. Yeah, yeah, the camera's not gonna reach that. Bro. It's so stinking cute looking in there and all these little puppy faces looking back. They're like, what's going on? Where are we? Hi, Bo. Oh, Bobby, are you check it out? Yeah, he's like, okay, maybe I can. There's a lot of other, other friendly puppies over here. Puppies! 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 Come on! Puppies! Oh, you tried to Clover! Come on, Bobby. Clover! Hi, puppies! Good girl, Clover! Hi, puppies. Come on! Hi, puppies! Is that uh, Desi? It's in the tray? No, it doesn't um, go up there. Never mind. Desi! Come on, Desi! Puppies. Good boy, Desi! Clover! 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 Come on, Clover! Alfie! Alfie! Good boy! Good boy! Alfie. You're such a good boy! You're such a good boy! Alfie has a very like... You're such a good boy! A floppy flop like... <laughs> He's so... He, did you guys see how like... How quickly he, he went running back? Yeah. Hi, Bo. Hi, Bo. Good girl. He was a man on a mission. Oh, look okay. at Bobby go. Well, hi! Charlotte. Hi, Charlotte. Hey, sweetheart. Who's a good girl? I'm just kidding. I think Clover's just scared. Clover. She's just sitting in the pellets. Hey, Charlotte. Oh, I think Piper is here, too. I think they're all nervous. A little nervous. Come on, guys. Because the, oh, you know what? The floor is a really different color, so. Yeah. All right, we'll start you off on the island that we can grip easily. Oh my god. It's like an island and then that's the water. Just look at <laughs> because you have to be able to swim. Hi Alfie. Uh, hi Alfie. Hi. Who's a good boy? Well, hello Maisie. there, Rocky. Hi, Maisie. Hi. Hi, Bo. You're Bo, right? Hey, you're Bo. Charlotte and Rocky. Bobby's like, I'm again. staying in the dry land. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Rocky. Everyone's fine. Hey, uh, Robin. Robin, there we go. Robin! Robin, come on. Come back here, sweetie. Hi, sweetie. All the puppies are gonna follow you. Elsie! Charlotte. Charlotte! Come on, Charlotte. Charlotte! Does she need to go potty? Alright. she go into the tray? She's <laughs> She's so oh, sorry. Sorry, son. Charlotte! Who's a good girl? Go oh, you're such a good girl. She came back. Hey, you wanna go potty, Charlotte? Hi, Charlotte. Lunar. Lunar. <laughs> they are so stinking cute. Hi. 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 Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Hi, sweetie. Hi, Lottie. Hi, Lottie, Lottie. Yes. Hi, Bob. You are always going to be my favorite. Yes. Yes. I will always have a space for you. Mm hmm. No. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Hey, Sunny. Hi. Hey, Sunny. Hey, Sunny. Hi. Oh, kisses. Kisses on the nose. I love you. Are you okay, Bo? Are you able to get back? Or are you just laying down? You look a little scared, sweetie. How about I bring you back? What are you doing, you goof? You goof. You're such a goof. Ah. I hope this has been a fun afternoon for you. Mm -hmm. Nothing like swimming lessons on the slick floor. Now, if anything, hopefully it strengthens up their muscles a little bit. Yeah. Oh, Charlotte, look at Charlotte on Robin. <laughs> She's like, another one that looks, mom? her um, thumbprints are really similar to Robin's. She can easily pass as a Robin puppy. Yeah, Robin puppy. And she doesn't even have the same parent, like either of the parents. Yeah. 
<laughs> she was determined to get on that nipple. Oh my goodness, I love you. I love you. They are. Oh, they're so snuggly. Oh, and I can always count on Bobby. Hi, oh, hi, Can you Bobby. always count on him to be scared? I can always count on him to be here. I guess I have Bo right now, but Bobby's right there. I can always count on him to snuggle me. Bobby. Charlotte, do you need to go potty? Do you need to go? I think she doesn't want it. The potty. I already put her in there once. This one? Yes, my Charlotte. I swear she's doing the potty. Because she's like snipping too. Potty. Uh, potty, Charlotte. Potty, sweetie. <laughs> she's like, what? You brought me all the way back here? I didn't know. It's a really far. Yeah, it's a long way to go. Happy. You are another really good doggy. You're a lot like Bobby. Alfie's a lot like Bobby, just probably a little bit more outgoing than Bobby. Alfie's just a little bit more social. Yes, you are. You are. You are. Bo is already spent. I guess she's been in here since the beginning. I, I have had enough. Entire you time. are a beautiful girl. You do are. Hey, you're so kind. Who's that? Are you amazing? Hey, puppies. Oh. Oh, it's okay. Rocky. It's all right. We'll Rocky, bring you back boy, to the Rocky. island. We will bring you back to the island. Rocky, good boy. Hi. Good boy, Rocky. Yeah. Bring you back to the island. Come here. Come here. Anyone else need help? Charlotte, why do you keep wandering that way? You're such a good boy, Elfie. Hey, Finn again. Hey, buddy. <laughs> You're such good puppies. Hi, Alfie. Hi, buddy. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. No, you are going potty. No. I told you she had a potty. I knew it. Uh, I, knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew she had a potty. She was so silly because I could put her in. No, Charlotte. Uh, I think she's playing most of it already. Stinker? No. Okay. Little action. Oh my God. We're creating a little puppy pile like right on the edge here. Like a yeah, they, like a this is what Daisy does to me at night. This is Daisy. Uh, one, two, this is me. Two. No, this is me. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. You want to get in on the puppy pile action? I can't believe that there are just about 14. There's 12 puppies. There are a dozen puppies on that bed. What I can't believe is that this is a dozen puppies and we can still fit six adult cavaliers on this bed. <laughs> Oh, oh, Charlotte. Hmm. The oldest Charlotte. It's like this big pile of heaven. Hi. Hi, Charlotte. My little girl. Yeah, that's it. Good. Tighten up those hips. Come on. Tighten them up. Squeeze them together. There you go. Like that. There you go. There you go. Good girl. Oh, bring them together. Bring them together. <laughs> Wait, I hear a... Oh, it looks like Rocky found gold. The liquid gold. Liquid gold. Liquid gold. They got breakfast kind of early today, so they've already had their, their meals. Their breakfast oh. slash lunch. Hey, Finn. Oh, Finnegan, are you jealous now? He is super, 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 like, affectionate and snuggly. And, yeah, Finnegan is awesome. Like, it's really, just in, like, the last week, it's really yeah. out. Hey, Finnegan. Yeah, his family. Alfie is oh, like love him. the trajectory that we've placed Alfie on. His he's like, yeah, he's exactly the kind of puppy that we thought he would be. Hi, and he's like, he's he's an even better version of what I pictured. Yeah, 
like he's much more outgoing than I expected. Yeah, he's pretty playful. And... Oh, he's gonna be so pretty right. with Ella and Murphy. Where's you want down? Where's you want down? You want down? Mm -hmm. Finnegan, you shut it, boy. Who's the boy? Arr. Hi, Alfie. Good boy. Hi, Alfie. Good boy. Good boy, Finnegan. Yeah, Charlotte. Um, when I when Mocha was in with Robin's puppies earlier in the past, I made the mistake of taking Robin over there. Uh -huh. Mocha was still in there. Robin no, was there and she would. Hey, no. She would start growling at Mocha as soon as she got there, and I have to, you know, swiftly pull Mocha out and all that. And this morning, it's the same thing. Um, except that Robin went up there. She saw that Mocha was there and was just cool with it. Like, she would okay. just like greeted her instead of uh, growling at her. Huh. So I think that with the puppies being exposed to the other puppies, I think Robin is starting to understand that okay. they're, we're starting to kind of um, bring them closer to the other, uh, especially the puppies. She knows Mocha's just a puppy. Yeah. <clears throat> Mocha's just a little one. Oh, man. <laughs> Daisy's like protesting. She's up there. Yeah, she's like, this is BS. Look at them! Oh my goodness, I'm gonna spin this. You can see. Excuse me, Alfie. <laughs> Robin, <laughs> come here, you big old dog. Look at all these puppy dogs. What are you guys doing? <laughs> Mr. Alfie. That's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Just burp. Well, oh she had a very derpy look on her. Yeah. <laughs> too. Oh. What? <laughs> I shot again. Just around. Now. That's what that's what uh Charlotte was doing. She was um Robin was dragging her over stuff and through things and she was just along to the right because on the slick floor it's like just going on a slide. <laughs> Even in the basement, maybe, mm -hmm. but like if we're going to use that corner long term, maybe not even a pen area, but just like a play area, right? For the puppies, you can just work them up or, yeah. Well, they don't help. Almost well, the they, adhesive is like nasty. That's the nice. That's most, floor. Most, most of the time, the I wouldn't want to, I would want to try to not avoid using that and just like put them down. I thought they connected, I think they. They lock together. Yeah, so I wasn't too worried about the whole piece of art. Hi, puppies. <laughs> These two are like, we're not ready to go to bed yet. You guys are crazy. Thinking 
Again and again and again. Hi guys, you're on my foot. They're the ones that I can pull out of here. So I know. Yeah. Yeah, these two are little adventurers. They they have very little fear. Rocky. Good boy Rocky. He's a good boy, Rocky. Rocky. And again. Hi. Zoom. Zoom. Oh, yes, mate. Thank you. Right. Are they barking something? Yeah, they are. That's why I was going to start putting the puppies. Robin's back first because their stream is on. Those are running. Oh, right. Oh, Oops. their stream is running already. No, their stream is running on nothing. Oh, I see. So, yeah, this Char. and this button. And who is this? This is the Piper. Doodle. Doodle. And then, oh, doodle. There's Desi. Desi Doodle. Uh, Desi. Oh, did you really do that? Do what? Just, I, I'll, don't worry. I'll take that. Oh, no, I know. I just I did it. Adults. He could manage it okay ourselves. Seven, seven. Well, I should probably cut it myself. Love you. <laughs> 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 yum yum. <laughs> Love you. I didn't put to be so close. <laughs> munch, munch, munch. Munching away. Oh. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. This is why I didn't want him to do this. <laughs> it's nuts. Uh, yeah. Now, let's see. I've got that. The Lottie Dottie and the bow. I'm so sorry for the shakiness and all that. I'm not trying to make you throw up. Oh, dang it. I wanted to get in here and clean this up before we put the puppies back in. Oh, that's right. No, Let's 
Sunshine, you're such a good girl. Nice, Sunshine. You are. Yeah. You're so cute, Sunshine. Oh, you're going to have blue eyes, too. Yeah, they both are. Uh -huh. And Rocky. Nice. Good girl. Yeah, you're a good, good, good girl, Sunshine. You're a good girl, too, Charlotte. Hey. Oh yeah, you're gonna have very blue eyes. Huh. Thank you, buddy. Next. Sunshine. Good girl. You guys are dark blue colors. Okay, you go to sleep. Hang on, I'm sorry. I knew that I might have ordered it. I thought it was cheese, but it was just a little
You can put it in your child. Oh. Hey.
more time.
Hey Robin, I'll come for
Right here. There you go, kiddo. There you go, baby.
Hi, Finnegan. Mr. Finnegan. Oh, it's a Lottie. No, she is a Lottie. I'm sorry, Lottie. Lottie Dottie. Lottie Dottie. Lottie Dottie. Dottie. You're a fan again. What am I talking about, huh? What am I talking about? Say, Mr. Finnegan. Mr. Finnegan. Arr, Finnegan. And over here. Oh, goodness. Arr. Lottie Dottie. Lottie Dottie. But here is Mr. Rocky. Rocky. You silly puppies, you guys are all smashed up together and you're so funny.
That was Mocha. Oh, I didn't see that. Mocha. You are. Not long in high
れたりします。
Hey, May. Yeah. Would you mind going out and feeding the cats and taking care of them? No. No. Where'd it go? Dad, we need to get cat litter. It's going to be gone in the next couple days.
No.
Because they're so soft.
Hey, it's time to go now. Alright, now it's probably too cold for you. Get down from there. Get it all right.
Bella, were you eating candy? Bella. Never get a McDonald's or never get to do. Never get a McDonald's. What? Oh. Never get to that McDonald's. Never get to that McDonald's. That was because they were mad at us.
Oh, you know what? I didn't plug it in, so it died. Uh-huh. I didn't plug it in.
You are so silly, Danny Doodle. No, I was talking to Daisy. Whatever, whatever. 
Come on, Bella. Let's go.
Come on, Daisy. Thank <laughs> you. 
And we'll watch the new data thing. Because I think it's tomorrow being ready first day. Oh, but you know what? Maybe um, I can move it out. Sorry, but I was going to say, we got to run a blooming, so I need to pick up all these birthday dinners. So maybe oh, we also we go to the notary. We also need cat, cat litter. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. I know, I know, I know. And maybe we can, if we need, we can use uh, the pellets. I'm not going to use the old. I don't think we'll have to use the pellets. It'll be hard for them to dig, so they won't want to eat it. Hey, where'd you go? Right here. Yeah. Just want to give you a hug. Um. Oh, what was the the um? I will want to. That was a little sore. Right here. 
Four for survival, eight for maintenance, and twelve for coat. It is a lot of hugs. But, um, yeah, um, but I was thinking if I went with, or if I went to pick up at least, what they did over that now, I don't know. I don't even think I really need you. I think it's more for my signature. Yeah. But,
Come on, Daisy.
Hi there. Yes. Well, somebody's been somebody's been playing with the camera. Oh goodness, you silly, silly things. Oh, you know what? I should start time stamping the stream that starts as the kitchen stream. I'll start time stamping it um, that following morning. So I'm usually looking at them in the morning for thumbnails. So I'll start time stamping when we switch from kitchen cam to my run Remy. Um, I really liked how we did it today. When we instead of um, spending all the time getting this area ready for me, I prefer it essentially. Um, just bringing them into the kitchen, and then it'll be a lot easier to bring friends out to play. Um, so we can just put the dogs outside and bring in um, who we want the puppies to hang out with. And the kitchen's already puppy proof because we've got puppies in there all the time, Mocha. <laughs> I love how they play with little links, just like the kids do. That's Daisy. Hey, hey, body, body. <laughs> you guys are rough. You, they go for like the skin on their backs. That's owie. You guys are rough. Rough, rough, rough. Daisy Doodle. Can you get along since there's no food in there? Nice. Yeah, there's no food in there. See, plug on. You already went out. Remy's burning out from her puppies. Remy's burning out, but it's like a healthy amount. They they um, they're five weeks old. They need to wean off of mom too, socially. So. <clears throat> Remy still checks in on that quite a bit. Stop. There you go, Elfie. They were so much fun earlier today, slipping and sliding on the kitchen floor. If you missed it, you should be sure to rewind it. And yeah, they were so cute. Daisy. Why are you being so grouchy? <clears throat> Okay, Alfie, she's being a grouch. She's being a grouch. He's like, what'd I do? <laughs> Poor guy. Poor guy. Why are you being grouchy? Oh. 
Lottie had it, um, Bobby back like the back of his head. Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. Oh, hey, Bobby. Hi, buddy. You're such a good boy. Well, yeah. Did you know I'm a transformer? Oh, oh, oh I you want to see transform into? Um, uh, I can transform into a car. Okay. <laughs> I was saying, saying the name. We got big old paws. We need to trim our nails. Oh, I should turn them on today. Today. Bobby's are really sharp. I got to give you just for them. Just for them. Okay. Bobby. Okay. You want Bobby? I do. Bye bye, Bobby. I don't know. Have you talked to Vinny about sipping over? Uh, no. You want to do that?
Bradley, come say good night. Well, I guess you know, good night, but. Hey, you're not going to be able to hug me for five million years. All right. I love you. Happy early birthday. I'll see you in the morning. Only. You're going to hug me. Fine. It's like, it's the only way I can kiss you is by first grabbing my arm around you and then making you a kiss. It's like the only way I can give you a kiss. <laughs> it's impossible Look. for me to walk up and just kiss you. Look. Oh, eat the food bowl. Silly. She is silly. Dizzy. 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 Hold your head still. Now look at me. Look at me. No, come on, boop. Yeah, I booped her. I booped her on the nose. All right, I love you. I love you too. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
Man, who's tooting down here? Holy smokes. It smells like dog farts. All right, go potty, Bobby. Go potty, Bobby. I Hi, Daisy. Hi, Doodle. Love you. Love you too. See, the only way I can kiss you is if I put my arm around you and then give you a kiss. I noticed that in the morning when I, when you leave the bus, that like I can't kiss your head. I need to. I need to. Don't tease the puppies. <laughs> So silly. <laughs> don't leave that in there, okay? Why? Because I don't want to it off. I just take it off. Little pieces that can break off and I don't want them to eat something I shouldn't. It's really stable, nothing will fall off. Probably No, the toys that they have in there are especially made for dogs. That's especially made for dogs. Okay, it's time to take it out. <laughs> Love you. Oh, you too. at 9.30. Yeah, at 9.30. Oh! Oh, I think I left my phone up here. Yeah, it's right there. I love you. Oh. Love you. Love you. You will now not be able to love me for 500 million. Gosh, gosh. It's my birthday. I'll be able to watch tomorrow. All right. I love you. Love you too, bud. Come on, Daisy. <laughs> Not ringing. I Oh, 
What do you want? All right, Ross. What do you want? Guys, wake up. Man. Wake up. Come on, guys. Wakey, wakey.
Here, Daisy, you want to see the, oh, I see why you want to see the puppies, because you want the food. Well, you're not going to get the food.
No. No.
Paris, aren't you loving note? Hello, Paris. Paris, come here. Paris, come here. Paris, no. Come on. Paris, come on.
Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Bobby Barkman. Bobby Barker, yeah. I love you, Bobby Barker. Love you, Dad.
Sorry, Bobby. Hi, Bo. Hi, Bo. Hi, sweetie. Hi. Hi. Good boy, Bobby. Good go potty. Good boy. I had a feeling you had to potty. Good girl, Clover. That Clover. Darn it. Darn it. Little Clover looks so much alike. Thank you. 